Now, uh, of course, the holidays are over. Some resolutions already falling by the wayside. Get back in the gym, but spring is still a long time away in Chicago, and we have the seven simple tips to help cure the winter blues. I'm here with Donna Bazo, lifestyle expert and author. You're going to run right through them, and you just heard Tracy's forecast, so we need some help here. Totally. And, and, and notice they're wearing their winter blue colors. That's right. So <laughs> first thing is starting with helping yourself. Right. Self-care is the name of the game. Now, you always feel better when you look better. Um, so I say instead of going to the spa, which wouldn't that be great every day, go ahead and create your own beauty arsenal and have every day be sort of a mini spa day. Here are a few of my favorite beauty products to get you started. Incredible stuff. Now, uh, also music's a big part of this, isn't it? Experts say that happy music makes you happy. So I say tuck in a pair of headphones for that um, long train ride, the walk to the bus, even lunch hour. Uma has some good brands and I love this. This is the VR headset. Um, it's great, especially for shut-ins and, and, and folks that are mm -hmm. can't get out because of icy roads. But not only can you watch movies on this, but you can watch live concerts and sporting events through certain um, subscription services. Mm -hmm. And, you know, it's a way to get out when you can't get out. It's incredible you can do that, especially, of course, with your smartphone. You should indulge a little bit, right? Absolutely. It's about $200, but if you take the price of tickets into consideration, mm -hmm. it could be worth the investment. All right. You look ready to go outside. <laughs> Being outside is important. you got to get some fresh air in all of this. So tell us about that. Well, you got to get outside. It's definitely a mood booster. It helps focus. And in Chicago, you know, getting those warm clothes is the name of the game, right? Yeah. So I so go cute, fun, and fashionable. Now, Mural and Play both have some boots. Now, they're not really boots. They're like high tops, but they have yeah. the functionality of boots. And maybe top it off with some fun socks from funsocks.com. Or I love these Manny gloves. Uh, they don't mess up your manicure. How about that? Oh, that's your very, spa important. Day. very important, of course. Uh, light therapy is very important because what we're really missing, you can feel like you, you just haven't had enough sunlight. So what do you do about that? Well, if you can't get outdoors, bring the outdoors in. Now, Verilexis is the newest and latest, mm, greatest light from right. Verilux. They call this the happy Happy Light Touch. I love it because you can stick it right in your purse. It's about $80 on Amazon.com. They say 30 minutes in front of a light box a day is almost as effective as an antidepressant. So yeah. worth trying if you're one of those people affected by the season. And one of the most age-old things to help you if you're not feeling so great is to go help someone else. Yes, helping someone else always makes you feel better. Now, Keshet is an organization here in mm -hmm. Chicago. Now, they will pair you up with disabled children and adults to play basketball every week at local gyms. So it gets you out, it gets you moving, and it gets you, you know, bringing joy into someone else's life. So what better way to cure the blues? You know, that works every single time. If you're feeling down, help someone else feel up, you'll feel great uh, as a result. Final thought. What about a book? I'm always telling my kids, you know what, you got nothing to do, read a book. Have you read every book in this house? No, read a book, right? Well, my plan is to burrow away with some special books, whether it's learning a new skill or just catching up on some of your favorite reading. Now, 30, 365 days of happiness is on my reading list. I mean, that's apropos for winter blues. And right. um, moms can always find things for their kids to do in my book, Fidget Busters, Busy Moms Who Want to Keep Those Kids right. Happily Occupied. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.